Hey, show. <laughs> Are you jealous of my lunch mat? Oh, would have been nice to have, I'm sure. Good morning. We got there. We got there. Ooh, I have eight legs. Good morning from me and Sagey. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> I thought it's been a while since I just done like a really casual family vlog in the morning. What do you want for breakfast? Do you want pancakes? No. Do you want smoothie? No. Do you want toast? No. no. What would you like? No. What would you like? No. How about, do you want to help mommy make pancakes? No. No. Do you still have a pee diaper? We gotta change your diaper. I feel like this is why I don't do morning vlogs because I'm always like, I look like poo and I'm just trying to get a toddler ready for the day and usually there's just like not time to film today's sunday so we oh my battery's dying luckily i have another battery oh ow here but i've been really good at waking up early in the morning before cg oh she's she came quick yes um that's a battery for the camera yeah it's a battery for the camera I've been really good at waking up at least half an hour before Sage. I'm trying to do an hour, and then during that time, I will do my five minute journal. I will meditate. I'm only doing 10 minutes of meditation right now. I used to do 30, and that was like the sweet spot. If I wake up earlier, I will like take a shower and get myself ready. That didn't happen today, it's the weekend. She wakes up at 7.30 in the morning. The goal would be for me to wake up at 6.30. I've been really good though, going to bed at like 10.30. Like that's, that's the key. You need to go to bed earlier so you can wake up earlier. I think Matt and I are gonna go to CrossFit, which means we gotta bring Seiji. Yeah, oh, she's taking all the things. Do you want to put the Do you want to put the lens on the camera? You want to put there? Okay. We'll see you out in the kitchen. Oh, good job. Okay. Do you want to take your vitamins? Uh, don't lick the counter. Don't lick the counter. <laughs> Luckily, I cleaned it last night. Okay, come here. Come here. Vitamin D. Uh. Okay. We'll, we'll come back to that. Uh. One, two, three. Okay. Here they are. They are vitamins. There they are. There you go. Probably use this one. It's very good. Do you want banana? What is it? A pear. Yeah. We're not having snacks for breakfast. We're gonna have. We're gonna have breakfast for breakfast. That makes sense. Here you go, banana. We don't need anything in that drawer right now. Okay. That's for later. That's for later. Okay. We can put blueberries in it if you want. All right, so I'm just pulling up the Baby Health Nut Cookbook on my phone. Coconut flour, blueberry, baby cakes. Super easy recipe. You're doing great. Yeah. This one's better for eating. This one's better for baking with. Are you done? Yeah. Yeah, one more time. One more time. Go! I did it. Yay. I figure we'll make pancakes for her and smoothies for us. Good. Wow. Whoa. Good. Can you put a little cinnamon? Good job. Perfect. Should wow. we put it? Wow, well, perfect. What's her favorite? Just a little sprinkle. So yeah, the last like couple weeks, I will say have been really rough with Sage. Felt like she was crying all day, every day. But something happened the last couple days. She's been so chill, so more like, she's been talking, pronouncing words so much better. She's been listening to direction, communicating more. Like something has just changed in her and I feel like we're in like the calm after the storm. Cause it was a rough storm, I'm not gonna lie. And you start to have like, you know, all this like mom negative talk in your head. Like, oh, it's something I'm doing. I'm not a good enough mom. And you know that's not the case, but that's the stuff that comes up in your head. And and now seeing her thrive and be this amazing two-year-old, I just like, I missed like just hanging out with her without her screaming. That's all, you know? Okay, can you wanna put that in there? And there's gonna be more storms. We're just in the eye of the storm right now. And I'm just soaking it up because- Thank you. 
you know, it's just like they're going through a lot at this age and it's easy to feel so frustrated as a parent and like overwhelmed and it just like tests all your boundaries. I've never had to like lean on Matt more. We also try to keep her busy. Like we do a lot of activities with her. We find like when she's active and we tire her out, she is just less less crazy emotions. Even though she does watch TV, like we try to limit it, limit it when she, you know, is getting a little crazy. Can you mix that for mom? Can you mix that? Thank you. Okay, is that? Delicious. Yeah, you mix it good. Wow, good mixing. So yeah, like I want to share more family real life vlogs like this, but also like we've been wow. in a hard phase. It's not that I don't want to share those hard times. It's just like you're in it, so you don't have time to do anything else. And when you have time, you don't want to be like filming it. <laughs> you know, you just want to be chilling and having some you time. Okay, are we going to put uh, blueberries in there? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Do you want to count? Go one. Two. Ha! Say two. Okay, what's One. next? Three. Five. Yeah. That's close. Yeah. Is this why you're giving mommy and daddy such Five. a hard time? Because you had all your... Six. Your brain hey. was working so hard. Oh, the blueberry hand. Yeah. Oh, my God. oh my gosh. Perfect. Thank you, sous chef. They are very blueberry-ish today. That's okay. Hey, show. Hey, show. Watch out. Okay, I'm gonna make a quick green smoothie. I have some leftover kale. Usually, if I'm going to the gym, I like to have a smoothie before the gym and then I'll maybe have a second breakfast when I get back if I'm still hungry. So, I'm just kind of using up stuff in the fridge. I'm use up the last bit of Sage's banana. I like to sometimes do a mix of spinach and kale. I have my homemade coconut milk. I just filmed a TikTok on how I make it. If it's up by the time this video goes live, I'll link it down below. I have a second batch here. It takes five seconds to make. Sage was in a huge smoothie phase. Right now she's not digging them. So that's just like the life of toddlers. One minute they're obsessed with something, the next they're like, mm, nah, I don't want it anymore. Oh, we lost a seed. So you just gotta roll with the punch it. This week, it's not smoothie week. Some spirulina powder. I'll put on the screen what I'm adding. I like adding berries because they have more fiber, they're more sugar balancing. I don't have any frozen bananas, so we're gonna just use fresh, which isn't ideal for smoothies, but whatever. Okay, water, ice, then we blend. Just gonna hold your hand. There you go. There you go. There you go, okay? Baby. You need maple syrup? No. Yeah, I knew you were gonna want some. Ah, there you go. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> You're smashing those. If that isn't a testimony on how good these are, they're also made with coconut flour. So they got fiber, they got protein, healthy fats. Does oh, coconut flour have protein? It? I think it does. Yeah. Are you all done? Yeah. That's her sign when she's all yeah. done. She tries to yeah. climb up. You know what? You did really good. You smashed those. Yeah. 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 Okay. I'm gonna go get ready for the gym. Okay. We gotta go. We got the diaper bag packed. Matt got sagey dress. You want to show what you're wearing? No. Okay. <laughs> I just want to be comfy in today's class. I think I'm gonna wear a hat. Good job. I just need to get my water. Yeah. All right, we've made it. High five. Yeah. <laughs> it's always an accomplishment when we make it out of the house. We have 10 minutes to get to the gym and that's just enough time to like set up the or set up for sage so we can work out i didn't explain but usually when i'm giving sage milk in the morning um, matt will go shower and get himself ready if i haven't gotten myself ready before she wakes up i will go get ready while she's like eating her dinner and stuff and i'll usually just like throw down clothes for matt to put her into and that's kind of like our situation in the morning but let me know if you want me to do more of a breakdown on like how we share and split up stuff with sage and just like 
our routine with like work and parenting and just life in general because I know everyone does things differently. It's a gorgeous sunny day. We're actually heading to my parents later today for Super Bowl. I'm really just going for the snacks and halftime show. I think Rihanna is performing. I, I think it's Rihanna. Anyway, so that's all I'm going for. Um, and it's funny because it's like at 6.30 and normally I would have thought, oh, like that's early. I'm like 6.30, like Sage's bedtime's in an hour. So I think she's going to go to bed a little later tonight because uh, I want to make it for the, the whole thing. No, but I want to at least make it to the halftime. After the halftime, we can go. And yeah. that's, I think, it's probably like 8, 8.30. Yeah, exactly. So that's the plan. <laughs> oh, sunshine. Anyways, I just feel like these are the days I feel weird vlogging because I'm like just kind of going through our, our routine and stuff and not really thinking about what I'm capturing and what I look like and all that. But that's just like how you're able to even vlog with a toddler and also just capture real life moments. It's like, you can't plan it. It is what it is. Oh. We'll see how this goes. Last time she was like screaming for half the class. So hopefully today's a little better. Is your hair She has her hat and boots on. I think it's cold, honey. Should I go inside? Oh, your hands are cold. She goes outside, closes the door, says bye. Say wait. Okay. Say good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good job. Here, no. Give it to her. Good job. What's for lunch? We have some leftover sourdough homemade pizza that Daddy made, and then I just put a side of some carrot sticks and bell pepper. We got water. We good. Go. Arr. Are you strong enough? Arr. Yeah. 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 I'm just finishing my second glass of smoothie from this morning. And I'm gonna go shower and then I'm having leftover enchiladas for lunch today. I'm probably gonna eat early because I'm starving. <laughs> that workout definitely made me hungry. Oh, I'm so hungry. Can mommy have a carrot? Can I have a bite? No. No, okay. Oh, you give me your chewed up bell pepper, I see. Mmm. That's daddy. That's daddy's? Red bell peppers are the best. We had a little bit of a meltdown with um, this one here, this stuffy, um, because she was rubbing it in her pizza, but this was our compromise. She can hang out here. Are we done? What's happening? Yes. Are you all done? Yeah. Yeah. We ate too many snacks at CrossFit. No, we eat at in the, the kitchen. We eat at the table. We eat in the kitchen. You can eat your pizza on the table or you can eat it up here. Which one would you like? Want to eat there? Oh, okay. Want to eat? Okay. Do you want apple too? No, this one's a little soft anyways. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go shower off this sweaty mess and probably wash my hair today. You good, Matt? Yeah. Um, I am showered, got my sweats on, ignore the pile of clothes there. I've actually been using this winter skin gradual uh, tanning lotion. I'll let you guys know if I think it works. And I ended up not washing my hair. I just thought I could revive it and curl it and hopefully make it through another day. So I hear Sage whining downstairs. Matt's been, ooh, 
Matt's been playing with her. I'm so hungry, so I'm gonna go have some lunch and then figure out the dip that I'm gonna make for my mom's for Super Bowl. What are you doing? What's up? You having crackers? Mom. Well, you're a big girl. You got your... Everybody was asking about her bunny slippers. Mom, Mom, Mom. I'll link them down below. All right, these are the enchiladas I made last night. There's two left over. They're so good. They're made with the almond flour siete tortillas. Uh, they're the siete enchilada sauce. Oh, shredded chicken and... I think that's it. It was really easy to make. I made it in the Instant Pot and then baked it in the oven. I'm just gonna heat up a pan with some oil. I'm feeling like I'm gonna have to have something else on the side though, I'm pretty hungry. Oh, and there's also some shredded cheese that we baked on top. It was really, really good. The kitchen is already a mess. Asparagus on first. It's looking good. I get asked a lot about how I have energy to do stuff, be a mom, work, work out. And like the truth is, I just feel like I don't have the time not to work out or eat healthy and make health homemade meals. When I don't do that, that's when my energy just plummets. I feel more tired. I feel like everything is really overwhelming. Like if say you're just having a meltdown, I just can't cope with it as easily. For me, it is so important to fill my cup up first before I'm able to do anything else for anybody else and have the energy to, you know, do what I need to do in the next 12 hours or 16 hours. How long is a day? <laughs> How long do I sleep? I have certain check boxes that I like to check off in a day and some of them are meditation, whether that's 10 minutes or 30 minutes, even five minutes if that's what you have time for. Uh, going outside in some way, shape or form and moving my body, whether that's walking or CrossFit or doing some gentle yoga flows at home. Um, you know, YouTube, you can find lots of free exercises and a workout doesn't have to be an hour long. It can be 20 minutes, it can be 10 minutes, it can be just stretching or recovery, like rolling out your legs and, you know, doing some stretching. That is my motivation on why I do things like take care of my body, work out. I know some people will look at people who go to the gym and they're just like, I could never, I don't have the energy, I'm so tired. I can't even imagine putting that on my plate as well. And let me tell you from experience, like when you do those things, and I say it to Matt all the time, I'm like, oh wow, this week, like I feel like I did more for me and I just feel more energized. I feel like I can do more and be more to those around me. And so, you know, try it out. Take a week and fill it in with some things for you and just see how you feel at the end of the week. Did you have more energy? Do you feel more tired? There's obviously gonna be an adjustment period, but it makes a huge difference and that is how I have the energy, is taking care of myself, my body, um, so that I can have the energy I need to be a mom, run after a two-year-old, play with her, really enjoy this high energy time with her. And also I want energy too, to do the things that I want. So I'm just playing with my two-year-olds. Like we went skiing the other day and that was really fun. And I wanna be able to do those things as I continue to age and get older. And in order for me to do that, it's taking care of my body. Okay, I think asparagus is probably almost done. Matt is putting Sage down for her nap. Usually he'll do nap time during the day and then I'll do bedtime nap. Sometimes I'll get switched up, um, but that's usually how we do it. So we just split it evenly. It helps one person not feel like they're doing everything because that's usually how it is with couples. I'm gonna do a quick cleanup while that finishes heating up and then I can sit down and enjoy my meal in some peace and quiet. I hear Sage giving Matt a hard time. Thank God she's a good sleeper, man. <laughs> when she hits that bed, she's out. We had this last night and it was so tasty. One of my favorite dinners that I've made recently. So it's definitely gonna be on rotation. I cooked up some extra asparagus if you want some. I loaded it with sour cream, guac, and salsa. And I put some blackberries on the side. Are you jealous of my lunch, Matt? Oh, it would've been nice to have, I'm sure. That's okay. Mm. All right, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. But I hope the halftime show is good because that's really all I'm going for, so. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have a fabulous day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.